am here in the Nature Center Gallery in this awesome beaver lodge. Beavers are one of the really cool animals that we have here in Virginia, and of course they love to be in and around water. We are gonna read a story called The River, and then we're gonna go explore some of the animals that we have here in our Nature Center that also live in the James River. All right, if you're ready, let's go. The River, an epic journey to the sea. In snow-capped mountains among the firs, the north wind blows, something stirs. Through icy water, a small fish darts. This is where her journey starts. The river sparkles under a sunlit sky. Overhead, white snow geese fly. Down the mountain, through ice flows, on and on the little fish goes. Through pine forests, still as night, the water glints in dappled light. A deer looks up and sniffs the air, the fish travels on to who knows where. Faster, faster, the wide river flows, rushing, gushing, then it slows. Busy beavers scamper and scurry, the fish swims on, hurry, hurry. The moon shines down, the whole world sleeps. Below, the little fish dives and leaps. An owl hoots softly, branches sway, the fish continues on her way. On the river bank, two bear cubs play, and so begins a brand new day. Through snow and wind and rain and sun, the fish must finish what she's begun. The days grow longer, the air is still, the fish swims on and on until... The river has become a sea. This is where she's meant to be. That is such a cool book. Let's take some time and meet some of the fish in the nature center, and then we'll meet my very favorite nature center animal when we make an activity. It has been so hot outside lately, so today, instead of making a craft, I thought we could make Louie the Otter some nice ice treats to keep him cool. We give our animals lots of enrichment to keep them active and engaged. Just like we like to eat treats and play with new toys, animals do too. All I'm doing is filling ice cube trays with things that are safe for Louie to eat, like food coloring, blueberries, and peas. Louie loves to smell different things play with the different texture foods, and see different colors, so this will be extra fun for him. Into the freezer they go, and in a few hours, Louie will have a really awesome treat. Where'd Louie go? Oh, it looks like he wanted to take a swim. Let's go along with him.
If you want to be just like Louis the Otter, you can make your very own ice treats for yourself at home. I like to make mine using juice and any kind of berries I have in the fridge. Today I have blueberries just like Louis. All you have to do is pour your juice into some cups and then put the berries in, put them in the freezer for a little while, wait for them to freeze up just a little bit, and then you can take a chopstick or anything you have at home and stick it in the middle. That way it's sure to stay right in the center. Take them out after a couple of hours and then you have some popsicles. All right, it's been a few hours, so out of the freezer and warm up the sides with your hands a little bit and it should pop right out. We hope you had such a good time today hanging out with us and especially Louie the Otter. Hope to see you next time.